Thank you. Yeah, no, genuinely, it's very nice to be here. I have spent the last year of my life uh, living in Germany, studying maths. Um, so it's a bit of a strange one. Uh, and I've kind of been learning German and trying to write stuff in German as well. So does anyone here speak German? Has anyone here heard of a place called Germany? <laughs> good, perfect. It's a good start. Um, so the German language is very logical, and I like it because you can just stick two words together. The German word for fridge is Kühlschrank, which means cold cupboard. So I find it cute. They would say it was logical, and why wouldn't a cold cupboard be called a cold cupboard? Um, but also you can just stick two words together. So uh, the German word for meat is Fleisch. The German word for salad is Salad. And in a restaurant, you can order a Fleisch Salat, which is a meat salad, which is just lots of meat. Um, so I kind of, <laughs> I invented my own word. The German word for falafel is falafel. And the German word for spoon is Luffel. So does anyone want to guess what the word falafel Luffel means? <laughs> falafel spoon, correct, which is a spoon that you would use to eat falafel. Uh, so this is a poem about falafel spoons. It starts in German, but we'll get through. There's also an audience participation part, so we should be fine. It's about a guy called Phil. <laughs> Phil is full. Die Nacht ist gut verlaufen. Phil sieht ein Geschäft und er fragt für sie verkaufen. Falafel Löffel. Falafel, fil falafel. Which is uh, falafel spoons for spoonfuls of falafel. Falafel, fil falafel. Falafel, falafel. Yeah, falafel, falafel. Falafel, fil falafel. Phil doesn't speak German, so he's left a little baffled. <laughs> See, there's his fella, Phil. And Phil loved falafel. In a falafel raffle, he would snaffle all the tickets. Always answers in affirmative to offers of falafel, even if he's awful, evil, evil, awful if he didn't. <laughs> and for us, it might feel effortless to live a life falafelless. <laughs> but Phil effervesces unless he gets his falafel fixed, so if philanthropically offered luffel of falafel, he says yes, despite not knowing what the effalafel is, a such ya. Well, a nearby person toy falafel sin. For Phil, a life of love and laughter will have a falafel after. So he says yes to spite not knowing what the F falafel is. If a falafel fell off a falafel, fell it fell awful. <laughs> so it's yes to spite not knowing what the F falafel is. A filthy falafel is often iffy if he's honest, yet it's yes to spite not knowing what the F falafel is. If half a falafel of filthy falafel is overly lethal, even as you leave it, he's like a message for his kids, he tell him yes to spite not knowing what the F falafel is. In my yard, when I some toy falafel sins. So when I say, we feel falafel, zoo feel falafel. Which means, how much falafel is too much falafel? <laughs> Could you reply with, fear luffel fil falafel is zoo feel falafel? <laughs> Which means, four spoonfuls of falafel is too much falafel. So, fear, four, luffel fil spoon, falafel is zoo feel falafel. Fear luffel fil falafel is zoo feel falafel. V feel falafel is zoo feel falafel. Fear luffel falafel is zoo feel falafel. V feel falafel is zoo feel falafel. Louder! V feel falafel is zoo feel falafel. Schneller! V feel falafel is zoo feel falafel. Be a little for falafel, zoo feel falafel. If he left them on his deathbed with a message for his kids saying yes, despite not knowing what the f falafel is, in my yard when I live with some toy falafels in Phil far full. Die Nacht war gut verlaufen. Phil sah ein Geschäft und er fragte, was sie verkaufen. Falafel, 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 ja, falafel, 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 falafel. You've got to make an effort when you travel. Um, thank you.